What's going on folks, Ted from Nerd Immersion here and welcome to what I like to call Ted's having his mother-in-law and two sister-in-laws over his house and needs to clean the basement so I have to get through all of these things that I've received that I haven't had a chance to unbox so I'm doing a very quick rundown of as many of those as I can in as short a period of time as possible so while I may be wearing this same outfit in videos you see for the next couple weeks know that that's why things were filmed so quickly. This time I have Baphomet which I know he's right here I'll show you in a second. Uh, the Horned King. This is a WizKids Mini. Uh, it was given to me by the WizKids teams actually at PAX Unplugged in person. So this was an open box one. They did also were nice enough to package everything back up for me. Um, but it was one you might have seen on display were you at PAX Unplugged. Baphomet is one of the Demon Lords. Uh, made famous in a variety of different content. Most recently appearing in Out of the Abyss, the 5th edition campaign. Uh, he is the Horned King, also known as like the Butcher, and you can see he's got this big kind of cleaver here. A sizable, nice looking mini, and it's on its way if you want to complete your collection of the Demon Lords. We have a variety of them we've received so far in the past. You've seen things like Orcus. I believe they also have a Demogorgon as well as a Jewyblex. Uh, we now have Baphomet, and then I think Zugitmoy and the others will likely be appearing uh, probably before 2023 is done. Um, it is not out yet, I don't believe. I think early March is when it's set to become available, or or perhaps it is... Actually, you know what? That's on Amazon. Let's just check uh, WizKids real quick and see. I know the release date is sometime. It might have been end of last year. Let's see. Baphomet is in stock. So it is available for purchase right now. Uh, looks like it's about four and a half inches tall. This is a 75 millimeter base. We're sticking with our classic now new WizKids look of the clear bases. So you can see the mat that you sit it on underneath. Uh, the Horn King and the Prince of Beast. He rules over minotaurs and others with savage hearts. He's worshipped by those who want to break the confines of civility and unleash their bestial natures. For Baphomet envisions a world without restraint where creatures live out their most savage desires. Looks like it's retailing for... 49 so about $50. Uh, I'll have an Amazon affiliate link if you'd like to pick it up. I'm going to go ahead and put him on the up-close cam. And remind me, as I, I just have to update my camera angle as he's a lot larger than the minis I was doing before. So let's go ahead and bring this in here. Here you go. We can kind of have to tilt this up a tiny bit and get ourselves in focus here. Now this is a beautiful miniature. Now it might not look like too much, but I think you can really tell the definition in all of the hair. The face has got this really kind of just menacing demon lord vibe to him here. You can see again, the tail was two pieces. This is just a key way, tail pops right out, no big deal. Um, and I mean, this could serve a variety of different demons. You can see here's his cleaver. Look at all the detail of the blood and everything. This is a, again, it was also very interesting to me to learn that WizKids does all of their miniature painting by hand, um, which I thought was pretty interesting. And this, I think, just absolutely knocks it out of the park. This is a fantastic sculpt. I love the design, and I do think, you know, especially when you get into the much larger miniatures like this, WizKids has a really good handle on them, although the smaller ones have gotten better. But it does seem to bounce between, you know, depending on which set you've got uh quality can come and go but baphomet here is uh is awesome i'm very excited to add him to my growing collection of demon lords so there you go folks that is my review of baphomet the horned king from WizKids. Not too much to talk about. These larger minis, there's not a lot to go through, so these are usually quick hit videos, but let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments down below. It's a sizable mini, but it is $50. I think that's probably around the price I would expect to pay for something that size, but let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments down below. I'll see you all next time.